I'd like, Roseanne, would you like to comment, uh, make a few comments, maybe respond to what you heard, or is there something you'd like to Well, I can add? say a few things. Like Please. one thing is uh, Sarah Palin, she, uh, she, she sits up there in Alaska, which is mostly oh, only 1% on. of the citizens of Alaska own property. Because Alaska is like, you know, like national parks. And I mean, the citizens, once again, like I said before, when the citizens own something, I guess that's the invitation for them to run in and steal every, uh, you know, square inch of it and pocket the money. I mean, it's just like, it's just like this thievery that you've never even seen before. It's run by sociopaths. But <laughs> speaking of Sarah Palin and sociopaths, which she is, she is using a private company that Ted Stevens' brother-in-law runs up there to uh, bring lawsuits against the United States government for the uh, treaties that they have with the native Alaskan tribes so that she can drill over there in their cemeteries. I mean, we talk about, like, um, you know, uh, ethnic cleansing and stuff. I mean, it's right here. It's in our country. It's by our leaders. It's happening right now in Pine Ridge Reservation. Um, you know, uh, those kids there, they... They, those kids in Pine Ridge, uh, you know, uh, they have no schools. It's the poorest place in America. And like a few years ago, I, I wanted to do something to help the poorest place. You know, the little bit I can do, I, I try to do. But uh, they, the, the, the children in Pine Ridge, uh, they dig through landfills to get stuff to burn because they freeze in the winter. I mean, this is America. I mean, we really don't have to... <laughs> It, there's ethnic cleansing in America right now, uh, you know, by people that are running for vice president. She took away uh, subsistence for, uh, fishing for people who that's how they survive. I mean, if it isn't just the biggest red flag about the loss of America's soul, I mean, what the hell? But I just want to say, oh, we can all go on forever with the name and all the shit that's going down, you know. I mean, everybody sees it. Everybody knows. Um, everybody Know some, you know, knows the worst stories in the world. But what the hell are we going to do about it? I mean, what are we, I mean, we're running out of time. Also, nobody's saying that, uh, you know, uh, uh, next to every uh, army base, you know, in, in the United States is a, a, you know, a place to put people. Uh, there's 250, it's something like that. I mean, I might be wrong on the number, but there are lots and lots of places to detain population, whether they're immigrant workers or whatever. I mean, what the hell are we going to do about it? Besides just like, I guess just I, sometimes I'm like, well, one word, sometimes the, just words, of one spark can set the words, a world, the woods on fire. But what the hell are we going to do about it besides just talking? I don't know. Is there anything else that we can do besides just talking is talking enough? Sometimes I think Christ, it is enough. I mean, at least at the start of something. But, oh, my God, we should be talking about it to everybody we see on the street every minute of our lives. Yeah. What are we going to do? Does anybody have any ideas? What are we going to do? Where's the solution? I'd like to talk about solutions. I know Cindy, Cindy's, like, thought things deeply through, and she has solutions. That's, that's why I like her. She doesn't just bitch, you know. I mean, she's got solutions. <laughs> And, and uh, I want to say also that, you know, I support Cynthia McKinney, who's running the Green Party president. <laughs> Cynthia McKinney, she has solutions all day and four days. she got 24-7 solutions. She can't get on any place. And, you know, I mean, if you come to my website, which, you know, I'm, like, putting all my money into for as long as my money's going to last, hopefully, whatever. i got a lot of kids and stuff, too. But <laughs> <laughs> I got people for days, but uh, thank God. But I got a website, RoseanneWorld.com, and I, I try to put on stuff that Cindy writes, that Cynthia McKinney writes. I, I try to put on stuff from the left that nobody is putting anywhere. So, you know, if y'all want to come there and post things or just read things, uh, do so. There's a lot about Pine Ridge. There's a lot about the Inuit tribes in Alaska. There's about a lot about ethnic cleansing in America. I mean, we have to do something, right? Uh, we have to do something. I don't know what, but the hell. <laughs> Man, I'll slap Nancy Pelosi right in her face. That's what I want to say. If I, if I ever happen on Nancy Pelosi and any of these uh, things that, you know, sometimes me and her go in the same, end up in the same circles, I will walk right up to Nancy Pelosi and slap her right across the face, as I will, as I will about everybody else in this damn government. <laughs>